What is up heroes, this is Midnight Zero, and welcome back to Let's Play Celeste Blind. In the last episode, we made our way through the, uh, what was it called again? The, the old site. In this episode, we have made our way to the hotel. I have taken a little bit of a break between the last episode and this episode, but I'm super eager to get back into this game because I've been having a blast with it so far, and I hope you guys have been enjoying it as well. And, I guess, really, I mean, all that's left to do is continue climbing. So we'll hop into it. Be proud of your death count. The more you die, the more you're learning. Keep going. Wow, such such positive advice. And honestly, it's so true. When I was learning how to ski as a kid, my dad would always tell me, if you're not falling, you're not trying. If you're not falling, you're not learning. If you're not falling, you're not pushing yourself. And that's a very that's very true, right? It's a very solid guideline. So long as obviously whatever going over your your limit. Uh, entails isn't actually too risky or too detrimental of an outcome but but it's a fair it's a fair point if you know the higher your death count the more attempts you're giving and that in and of itself is you know a valiant thing um okay so here we are at the hotel let's see what's going on what in the world is all of that is it gonna kill me probably <clears throat> i guess i just had to figure it out right <laughs> Want to keep an eye out for strawberries. I feel like I should be able to get one up there, but maybe I can't. Oh well. Oh, and now we got some moving goo or whatever it is. I'm going to have to keep an eye out for breakable surfaces or secret entrances or whatever it may be. So we can go like this. <clears throat> this is going to boing us up like that. I think what I can do is jump over this and then dash back onto here. So we'll try doing that in a moment. Cool. So we did that. And now we can head over. We've obtained a strawberry. So yeah, forgive my, uh, my skills might be a little bit rusty, but anything up here? Nope. Okay. Ooh, we got quite the uh, interesting situation here. Am I supposed to get up there? Or how else am I gonna... Hmm. Maybe something like that. Like I gotta jump over here and then go diagonally up? No? Hmm. Well that leaves me awfully curious. And there's really nothing up here? No? Can I like dash through it? No? And how in the world am I supposed to get that? And that's just not gonna happen. Maybe can I can I cling to the side of this? Hmm. I can. Oh, wait a minute. <clears throat> when I transition screens, I get my dash back. That's the learning point of this entire thing. So I dash, and now I immediately get it back. Or right, let's try that again. Dash, and do I have it back? I do. Wow, so that's really valuable information. And that's why we were incentivized, well, to learn that information via a strawberry. Oh, I thought this was an auto-scroller for a second, because I was moving to the right, and it was just, like, gradually going up. Okay, so we have a key here we obviously need to get, but, uh, oh, can I not? Gotcha. Um, we'll do this, and then, there we go. Cool, so we've obtained the key. However, I knew it. There's something up here. Can I go up there? No, I can't. Huh. It looks like I may have to, uh, yeah, I probably won't be able to make that. Maybe the, if the angle's like just right, and I were a true like speed runner or something like that, I'd be able to do it. But as it seems now, it looks like I'll have to go from the other side of this wall. So let's head on over. That was a pretty authoritative sound effect. Ooh, I love how the light like bends around where it's visible. Can we go up here? No? Okay. What if I have a dash? Nope. Okay, what about up here? Nope, there, nope, okay. 
Please ring for service. Say no more. <laughs> I love the, the sound effect and building up a horror and everything. Absolutely love it. Welcome, may I help you? Are you a ghost? A ghost? Don't be silly. I'm the concierge of this fine establishment. Welcome to the world-renowned Celestial Resort Hotel. Mr. Oshiro at your service. Two guests in one day. Business is finally picking up. Ooh, who was the other guest? Is it our dark side? How long will you be staying with us? Oh, I'm just passing through. I'm climbing the mountain. Do you have a back exit? <laughs> a back exit? Just passing through. This will not do. You know I can still hear you, right? <laughs> In any case, our rear service door is reserved for hotel staff only. However, our top floor presidential suite features a world-class view of the peak. Yes, you'll be quite comfortable up there. Maybe I could get on the roof from there and climb down the back. Ooh, the presidential suite. Marvelous idea, Oshiro. What's your name for our records? I'm Madeline. But again, I'm really not interested in staying. Right this way, Miss Madeline. So it looks like that's where we're heading. However, I will not be content until I've explored going up this way. No? Doesn't seem like... How about up here? No? Okay. Alright, then I can't think of too much else to do in this room. It appears to be a very old and dusty guest book. Many of the pages are damaged or missing. The comments, however, are glowing. We'll never forget our time here. I've never felt more at peace. Thank you. Interesting. Those could both go a couple different ways. Oh, that's really funny. They have the, they ring the bell if you do this. Yeah, you could say like, I'll never forget my time here, as in it was so like unforgettably bad, or, or what, right? Oh yeah, just this way. Okay. Anything going on of interest up there? No. Okay. All right. Is this gonna fall on me or no? Is it stable platform? Yes, no, maybe? Looks like it for the most part at least. Gotcha. Cool. Oh! Really? The last one? The last one is the one they decide to make the uh, unstable platform? After just like comforting you with the idea of, oh yeah, these platforms are pretty stable. And then all of a sudden, they're like, nope, now you're gonna fall and die. Alright, let's let's uh, let's be a little bit more intentional about this jump here. Okay. So why is this one unstable? It looks like it's kind of attached to the window behind it. Regardless, it's uh, good to know, I guess. I feel like I still missed an opportunity to go upwards. Maybe... Maybe that middle platform. Hmm. I'll test it out maybe another time. Regardless. Anything up here? No? Oh! Oh, interesting. So that's probably gonna move as the switches go down. Gotcha. Huh? Did I... Oh, I didn't even realize <laughs> that I had to hit that. That's pretty funny. Ooh, so there's a key up here, and that's obviously our, our goal. So let's go ahead and do that. These red blobs are moving in such a way that we don't... Our, our resting points throughout the level aren't exactly uh, guaranteed. Oh, wait. I didn't even realize that there was on the, on the ground over there. Darn. Alright, and now, there we go. We are all set. And now we just gotta time this, really. Anything up here of interest? No? Ooh, the music. The music's picking up a bit. I'm digging it. What, what do those things do? Do they move me? Do I fall? What do they do? Oh, they become that after I stay on them once. 
Interesting, so it's like a one-time dealio. Gotcha. <clears throat> okay, so what I'm gonna wanna do then is, I don't know, maybe do something like this and then over and then down. Oops, that was supposed to be downward movement. Obviously didn't turn out that way. Am I gonna be able to dash up through this? I am. Okay. Interesting. Pretty cool mechanic, honestly. I probably should have tried to get up there. Let's do that, actually. Oh, wait, I can't do that because... No! Um... Hmm, would I ever be able to do that, though? Because I use my dash to get to that middle platform in the air anyways. So I don't, I can't think of any other way to get up there. Please follow me closely, Miss Madeline. The elevator is just down the hall. The hotel is in pretty rough shape. Is it really open for business? Of course we're open. The Celestial Resort Hotel would never close during prime tourism season. Rough shape? What did she mean by that? Oh, please allow me to carry your luggage. My bag? No thanks, I'll keep it. Hmm, very well. What a peculiar guest. <laughs> She's just not very trusting, and rightfully so. There's definitely something up there. The question is, how do I get up there? Hmm, is it possible for me to... I'm gonna, I'm gonna try again. By self-destructing. I just want to take a minute to, to take a look at it. Let's see here. Because there's got to be a better way of going about it. <clears throat> I feel like I can save my dash on this middle part. So I can like do this, etc. Do this now. If I really time my jump well, there we go. No, but I messed up that part. Okay, what I actually need to do is go on this side of the platform and then jump and dash. And then I'll be able to get up there. All right. Up we go. There we go. Now, we've got a series of dash sequences it seems. Looks like it. All right, let's uh let's give it a go. Oops. <laughs> Oops, indeed. Such a violent <laughs> screen shake when you break one of those gems. Regardless, that was what I wanted to accomplish, so we'll uh, dash through. Aw, it didn't ring the bell that time. Okay. Oh, this here, is that going to fall or what? It's moving around like it will. Regardless, it doesn't seem like it is. Let's see here, can I make it over like that? No, I can't. So I'll probably have to, well, I feel like I should try to do so without using my dash. Oh wait, no, I can replenish my dash right there. Oh man. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Oh, I didn't quite make it. Actually, you know what I can probably do is just this. Aw, oh, I can definitely do that, though. <laughs> and just not even deal with the timing there. Should probably wait until it's, like, all the way over, though. Something like that. Aw, oh, really? Oh, well. Here's what we'll do. Can I go up here? Anything else of interest? No? Okay, I guess not. <laughs> Here, I can probably make this easier by using my dash earlier than later. Yeah, with something like that. I wonder if there's something down here in the lower right part of the screen. Maybe. Maybe not. Is there something in that upper corner? There's a... Oh! This is one of those I can't dash. Right? So how am I going to do this then? Because as soon as I dash, just be safe. Yeah. 
Okay, um, I can do something like that. Okay. There we go. Interesting, I didn't realize that I could get over the tops of those platforms so easily. So I don't have a key, obviously I need to go up this way if I want to get that key. However, because the key is over there, and it looks like we can't quite go over there, what we're gonna end up doing is heading over this way and seeing what we find. Anything of interest up here? Will this fall? Nope, that was not what I wanted to do. That was also not what I wanted to do. That was... Alright, it looks like the uh, default is to just <laughs> slide up that little corner there. Okay, so I need to do this relatively quickly is what it looks like. Uh, and I'm going to have to get to the end platform, go down. I'm going to have to lower both of the end platforms a bit in order to drop between those pits and then get back on the platform, it seems. Gotcha. All right, so we'll do this, this, lower it a bit more, lower it a bit. They go back to their original position relatively quickly. Maybe I don't need to do that to the same degree I was anticipating. Ooh. Oh, you know what? I can probably wall jump off of the, the book piles at the bottom of the screen there. That's probably what I need to do. I'm now realizing though that the timing with how these are uh, moving is a little bit tighter than I gave the, the, the trap, I guess, credit for it first. There we go. Nice. Okay, moving on. Hey, wait, anything of interest up here? No, okay. But definitely up there. No, I messed it up. Yeah, I definitely messed it up. Let's try that again. There we go. So maybe this will lead to that strawberry we saw earlier in the level? It looks like the left half of this level is going to be the exit. Let's do this to maybe get a little bit of a grasp of what we're going to be dealing with. Okay. Cool, strawberry obtained. Oh, do I have to make my way all the way up there in order for it to count? Oh, I didn't even realize. <laughs> My bad. I didn't even realize I could attach to that wall on the right there. That would have made things a lot easier. Alright, now I'm getting antsy. Those of you that have seen my uh, Super Meat Boy Let's Play know that that tends to happen when I know the solution to a, uh, a puzzle. And just want to get to the part that messed me up. There we go. And nothing of interest up there? No. Okay. Cool. Then we successfully obtained that secret strawberry. Now we've got another one up there. And the question is, how in the world are we going to get up there to get it? At the moment, it looks like we're going to need to make our way to the right side of the level. And then go back to the left side and then back over to the right. So what I'm going to need to do then is maintain some of my platforms, is what that means. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. So if I do something like that... Yeah, what I'm going to have to do is... Ooh, this is going to be tough. I should have grabbed the other side.
No, too much jump. I wonder if I can just make it over in the first place. Let's try that, actually. No, it's not gonna work. Although I did run into... Okay, it's close, but not quite. Okay, I feel like what I need to do is do that. Basically jump over there and then dash all the way across and then fall to this first spiked column on the left and grab onto that. I'm not exactly confident that that'll be something I can uh, do very reasonably though. Hmm. Oh, I shouldn't have done that because that's a uh, confirmed death. Let's, let's think about this. Oh, is this what the pause button does? Wow, that's really interesting. Okay, what I'm gonna do, oh, darn it. Um, we're gonna go over here then, and we can think about things a little bit more carefully. Can I get up here without using my dash? No, I can't. Okay, so I just screwed up my chances then. Because I, I'm going to have to basically go over here and then dash across. I'll try this a bit. I don't want to uh, completely bore you guys, though. Oh, man. So close. I got the strawberry and made it back over there. Once I get my, once I get the strawberry, do I get a dash back? I thought it, it kind of looked like I did. If so, that is um, really helpful, and will probably save my life at that point. Ah, oh, darn. Yeah, I can't afford to do all of that climbing so early on in the setup, I guess. Doesn't look like it. No! <laughs> Darn it. Okay, so I think what my strategy should be instead. Oh, wait, I was gonna say is to go low and then up top. But what I really need to do is probably. Hmm. Well, something different. <laughs> I was gonna say, what if. I don't really use this surface. So what if I were to do something like this, and then go over, and then intentionally low down there? Oh wait, I just screwed that up. And if I intentionally go low on the other side of that platform, and then stay, or then completely dash over that second column, I think that will allow me to survive after I uh, fall. However, I definitely messed it up there. Regardless, um, <laughs> Well, we'll give it a second go. There we go. So this should be a lot more survivable than the last time. No! There we go. So I at least have the strawberry at this point. So that's progress. Um, I don't know if I'm really going to be able to get over here, but we'll give it a go, I guess? Yeah, okay, I didn't think so, but... Nevertheless, now we can safely move on. He says as he's now dying on the part that was uh, not giving him difficulties just a minute ago. What was I saying earlier about rushing or getting impatient? At least all of the music in this game is so chill. Like, super chill. Cool. Now, what's going on over here? What's up with this little setup up here? Anything of interest up this way, that way? No? Really? What about this way? Oh, so that's breakable. 
Then down we go. Oh my! Now this reminds me of Meat Boy. Ooh, almost had it. Cool. Success. Oh my! <laughs> that was not what I was anticipating. Alright, so let's plan this out real quick. I need to get each of those, right? I think... I've got an idea. Oh, that was... Well, that just kind of screwed things up a bit. But, you know what? We'll, um... We'll make do. Cool! I guess we made it work on the fly. Anything else of interest up here? No. Okay. Oh! Oh man, I was not ready for that. Now this reminds me of I Want to Be the Guy. Oh, I didn't see that it was on the right side up there. I should have been more vigilant looking ahead. Ah. Uh, I tried to keep going all the way to the left as long as I could, and then only, you know, of course hit directly up as late as possible, but... Cool. Made it through there. Anything else of interest? No. Okay. And we finally obtained the key. I had completely forgotten why we were going out through all those rooms. But that was the end result. We're making our way up to that uh, presidential suite. Living that comfortable life. Alright, so I'm going to have to dash through all of these. And time it just right, it seems. What if I go up here? Nope, doesn't seem like anything of interest. I'm curious, what's down these pits? But not curious enough to risk dying. Not like it would be that much of a payoff, or that much of a, you know, downfall, but... Miss Madeline, I really must implore you to keep up. I'm running a world-class establishment here. I don't have time to wait around for meandering guests. You really don't have to wait for me, I'm just looking for a way through this place. Oh, you know, you idiot, the customer is always right. Business is finally picking up and you lose your temper. I mean, he doesn't have a lot of practice actually appeasing the customer, it seems. Look at that, that twitching eye of his portrait. Oh, of course, Miss Madeline. My sincere apologies, I was out of line. Please, feel free to explore your leisure. Well then, don't mind if I do. Anything of interest up there? No? Okay. Oh my. There's quite a bit going on in here. I see him all the way over on the right side of the screen. There's gotta be something hidden in here. Like, gotta be. Clearly there's a door up there we're gonna need to find a key for. Let's see here. So there's the key. That's a dead end over there. What's down here? Anything of interest? Ooh, there's something down there. Or rather, there's something that will come out over there. So let's find that. Over this way? Absolutely. What? Why can I not get through this? Is it because of the light? No? Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Well, I don't really know what's going on there. We can head over this way and potentially see. Did that just lock behind me? No. Okay, good. What's up here? Anything else of interest up here? That thing again? There's one up there, too. Let's see what uh, our friend over here has to say. Oh, there's the key. How are we going to get that, though? Oh, uh, this clutter is out of control! You don't say. When did this happen? I don't even know where to begin. Mr. Oshiro, do you run this whole place by yourself? You're right, Miss Madeline. I'll never sort this mess out alone. It's hopeless. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Just breathe, Mr. Oshiro. Breathe. It's just a little spring cleaning. Well, more than a little. But I can help. You're too kind. But I wouldn't even bother. It's a lost cause. Oh. Well, I don't know why that 
happened, but also the music. Can we talk about that for a moment? Alright, we're gonna head over down here first. Ooh, okay, so that's clearly where... What, what is going on there? Is that the, the B side or whatever? These are gonna fall, aren't they? I'm gonna fall, I, apparently. Oh, did this... It blocked me! It blocked me! Okay. So that moved. Although, is this... Oh, wait. <laughs> I guess even if I have... Wonder if that's breakable over there. I'll never know. Um... I had to dash there. Gotcha. Okay, this is pretty neat. Oh, I can afford to just fall there. I didn't even realize that. That makes things a lot easier. I'm digging this music so much. Oh, I was too early. Oh well. Gotta be proud of my death count. Right? Oh, you know what I can do to help out, actually? Let's see here. Oh, I was thinking about it too much. Is I can actually downward dash, right? So I can do that to help out with the process. And if I'm going to be going up here anyways, I might as well... Oops. I thought I was going to be landing on top of that platform, but... I did not, unfortunately. So I should really just hold tight there. chill here for a moment. I think my end goal, I mean, is probably to go downward. Or is it, is it to go downward or to the right? I'm pretty sure that second, the very last red blob we have to get past is actually hiding some secret to the right. It might, actually, might not be that much of like a secret or anything, but we'll see. Let's see here. Ooh, it was. Alright. So let's figure this out then. How are we going to get over there? I think actually what's going to be difficult is how are we going to get back? I need to be leaving platforms for myself in order to get back. So let's do something like... That was not what I wanted to do. <laughs> let's do something like this. Do I have time before it shows up? I do. That's helpful. Okay. Oh no, there's a fly! <laughs> Why does this keep happening? Fly! It's been a couple days! Leave me alone! Please! Oh my goodness. Oh, and of course, now I... Oh. I didn't die. Interesting. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, am I gonna die? No! I messed that up. But this isn't actually as bad as it I thought it was. Yeah, that actually makes it look like there's so much more to work with and like that you potentially need to work with than you actually do. Is there something I'm missing? <laughs> Why are there all of the dash crystals there in the middle? The fly is literally on my computer screen right now. Alright, this, this needs to change. Alright, problem solved. I feel like I'm missing something because I didn't use all of those crystals. What I'm going to do is uh, I'll, I'll head over this way. Hopefully the door doesn't lock behind me. Hopefully I reset the room or whatever to think. Okay, doesn't look like there's anything up there. I don't know why I was so intent on having those crystals there. Regardless, I see it's all coming together. 
I, there's got to be something over here, right? Why else would they... What else is going on over here? There's got to be something I'm missing, right? Or not. I mean, it's possible that I'm not, but... Otherwise, that, that room is way, way too simple. I don't know. So there's a strawberry on the left, which we will absolutely be getting. Oh, I shouldn't have done that, but we're good. Cool. So is this the B-side? Or what? what is this? Whoa! Do we just like, do we tidy up all of the things or something? Huh? I hope I didn't mess something up. So he's over there. It looks like we managed to tidy up things for the most part. Oh, we're probably gonna have to find multiple of those switches. That's probably what's gonna happen. I haven't even begun cleaning and already I feel a renewed lightness of spirit. That's the power of positive thinking. And letting others do the work for you, apparently. Um, actually, I cleared out some of the clutter for you. Oh yes, thank you, Miss Madeline. But please, relax. And let the hotel staff handle it. Oshiro, you fool, you're losing her! Guests don't want to spend their time cleaning. <laughs> Are you okay? Yes, uh, of course. This is the finest hotel you'll ever visit, you see. How could I let my problems pile up like this? Clearly, you know, there's a lot to be said about uh, Mr. Oshiro and the psychological, you know, mindset or difficulties that he represents, right? Um, let's see here. Anything like that up there? No. No. Okay. Which way do we want to go first? Let's go up here, because, I don't know, I feel like it. What do we have going on here? Anything particularly difficult? Um... I need to be keen on using wall jumps rather than just climbing, because of, well, you know, limited stamina and all. So, there's quite the heart down there. I'm not exactly sure how to get it. Is it going to be another one of those, like, this is my, I don't know, heart, like, trapped in a prison or some, some, some other poetic moment? Seems like it, but it looks like there's a way to enter that area from below. So we'll have to give it a look. Alright, let's figure this out. Ah, uh, I see. Here we go. Actually, we're just gonna... We're gonna do that. Aw, oh, man. I feel like I need to keep my dash for that last part, actually. Just kind of a bummer. No, I need to use my dash for that. Cool, we're good. All right. That wasn't entirely intentional, but it actually didn't work out too, uh, too poorly. Oops, that uh, was not the plan, Madeline. Anything this way? No. Alright, up we go. Over this way and slide down. Oh, I should have paid attention. Let's see here. Hmm.
Oh, you know what? We have to do this a bit differently. Hmm. Wow, <laughs> that was a lot more, uh, that was not quite as clean as I would have liked. Ooh, are we gonna be picking up more clutter now? Dang, that was such a, that little animation, the sound effect and everything, so satisfying when you hit that switch. Or whatever this is. Okay, we got all that, and now it's even more cleaned up. We got a little bit more cleaning to do before we can get that key though. It's looking a lot nicer in here. Can you show me to the exit now? But Miss Madeline, you barely enjoy the myriad luxuries that our hotel has to offer. You can talk more once I finish cleaning. I'm very busy. Yes, because you're doing so much cleaning. Yes, young people have no respect these days. You're welcome. Sheesh. Alright. Have we gone through all of them? We went through that one. Did we go through this one? No, we didn't. I remember coming this way and then stopping. Is there something? Oh, I can swim? That's pretty cool. What's over here? An old paper sticks out from amid the clutter. Attention hotel staff! It is my sad duty to inform you that the Celestial Resort Hotel will close indefinitely following this season, due to circumstances beyond our control. It was an honor to have served alongside you all, as we worked tirelessly to ensure that our guests enjoyed the... Oh. <laughs> Enjoy the most hospitable and memorable experience possible. I write this with a heavy heart. This hotel has become my home. It's staff and patrons of my family. I will miss you all dearly. Mr. Oshiro. Okay. There's totally something up here. I knew it. <laughs> Ooh, is this like a hidden room or something? Wait, no! Okay, I was gonna say, don't be the end. Pico 8? Celeste? Huh? What is this? Oh my goodness, this is so cool! Is there a secret over here? No, okay, they're not gonna put a secret in this little guy. Wow! Can I... Oh, I can't wall climb. This is so cool, guys. Big fan, big fan. All right. Ooh, there's a strawberry up there. Can I get it? There we go. <laughs> oh my goodness. I am totally digging this. Do I go to the right or up? Oh, I gotta go up. Oh, and this is like the very beginning uh, level. Wow, I love this aesthetic! And the feel, I mean, it, it plays like a solid platformer as well. And then there's a key down there with the treasure chest. Alright, so here's what we'll do. And do that. Replenish that. Wall jump. Picked up a nice strawberry. Can we go to the right? No, okay. Then what we'll do is this, this, and then up and over, and we're good. I wonder, is this like a full-fledged like game? Like, how many levels are are there of this? It's cool. Oh, and the balloon is definitely going to be a uh, refresh. That's so great. Oh, this, you know what this reminds me of? Well, it's simultaneously Frogger and um, Ice Climber. So what I need to do is wall jump off of this onto one of the platforms. Oh, man. And then, and then what? How do I get up to the next one? Is the question. Oh, I bet I know what I need to do. I need to just kind of go for it after a certain point. Oh, wait, what? My bad, guys. What? No! Alright, we're gonna... Oh, it's timing us. How am I going to get up there? I don't see any place to wall jump. I really don't. 
Darn. I feel like I'm just messing up my angle or whatever. Just gotta like get up here and then up. Okay, yeah, that was what I ended up needing to do. Cool, then onward we go. Let's do, boing. Oh, that's right, I can't grab onto the wall. <laughs> that's right. So, okay, I've got an idea then. That was not enough. No. Hmm. How did I get up so high that, that first time? I don't know. Because I feel like I got up much higher. I think that's probably what I did. Even then, though, maybe... Ah. Oh. Hmm. Really gotta maximize my height there. Oh, you know what, I should probably... Yeah, I think that makes a lot more sense. Well, no. That didn't seem to work out too well before. I got an idea. That was not the idea, but that's okay. There we go. Okay, okay, we got two balloons here. Two balloons. All right, now we're at 1,000 feet, I think. Oops. Hmm. So I've got to make it my way on top of that platform on the right. Is I think what I'm what I'm seeing right now. But I don't see a really great way of actually getting up there. That was a wonderful jump. <laughs> what happens if I jump off screen like that? Can I wall jump off of the side of the screen though? Let's see. No, I can't. Actually, I wanna try one more time. Okay. Does not seem to be the case. Otherwise, I'm not seeing a way to really get up there without a balloon. There's got to be something I'm missing. Hmm. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I really want to complete this too. I really do. But I'm not seeing it. Is that gonna like fall? Is there a way to make that fall or something? Because like all I can really think of is, I don't know, what if I were to like, I don't know, do something like that. Maybe? I can do that and eventually make my way up here. I guess that worked. That was not very intuitive though, I'm sure. Oh man, and right off the bat, <laughs> we're fallen. Uh, 
Okay, I've got. A, I think I have a better idea of what I need to be doing now. No, I was off by a little bit. Ah, oh, and again, off by just a bit, just enough rather. Okay, and then what we'll do is this. Ah, oh, I thought I'd be better off wall jumping. I think I am. I really am. So let's uh, let's give that a go. Oh, I keep, I keep thinking, I'm like, huh, maybe if I take a better look at the level, I can analyze. And then I'm like, wait, I'm dying over and over. What happens if I wall jump here? Okay, I'm not going to make it over. So I absolutely need to wall jump there. Or, and use my dash, really. So then, really, what's all that different from going some other route? Right? Oh, the idea is that I'm supposed to have my double jump after I wall jump off of that wall. That's why I need to go up this way as opposed to any other way. Hmm, I need to angle that differently or something because as it is, as I'm currently going about it, it's just not going to happen. There we go. Old sight. Do we make it to the end? Celeste Mountain. This memorial to those perished on the climb. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Is this going to keep going? Are there just that many? I don't know how many more levels there are. But it's almost been an hour in this episode already. I'll go for like another 10 minutes. But I really want to finish this. How many levels are in the Pico 8? Right? Like, how many levels are there in this? I don't know. I wish I did. Oh, what? I swear I was pressing the button. There we go. Yeah, we're all like on level 14 now. Um Oh, I see. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> wow, those were some pretty crazy maneuvers there to keep things alive. <laughs> I can't even believe. <laughs> How long does this go? I want to play through these levels, I really do. But at the same time... I don't want to be, you know, playing an entirely, you know, other game within this game. I thought it would be like, you know, a fun few levels and not like this isn't fun though. You know, well, I'll do a little bit more, I guess. Hmm. Darn, I want to do it just before. Like that, but because of the effect, I thought I died. Let's try it again. Oh, I need to not hit that, I think, is the, the point. Huh. Let's try doing this. No? Okay. Hmm. 
That's what I need to do. Let's see here. I keep thinking I'm dying, but I'm staying alive, actually. Oh, again! I'm pretty sure the sound effect is pretty similar, or something, because I keep getting un- I'm not- I'm never sure of whether or not I'm actually alive or not. Finally. So now we're at 1800 feet, I think. Of course, I'm not gonna be able to make it up there on my own. Oh, and there's a platform moving down there. I was like, how am I supposed to get over to those balloons? And it looks like there are platforms that, uh, go through here. Ooh. So I'm gonna have to be pretty selective. Oh, uh, oh wait! I actually made it on cycle. So I need to calm down a little bit there. Not quite enough. Let's try it again. What? What? I swear I hit that! Ah. Uh. Another key, another treasure chest. So we get some cool wall jumping here, which is always a cool thing. Big fan of wall jumps. Those of you who watched uh, Super Meat Boy will definitely know that. Ah, I see what I need to do. All right. There we go. Okay, and we keep on going. Oh man, almost. Now what? What is this treasure chest thing? What did we just unlock? Huh? What in the world is going on? Oh, now I have two dashes? What? And it keeps going? So we had to kind of like intercept it there? Interesting. Okay. Hmm. So I definitely need to save my my jumps, but at the same time. How else am I going to climb this area? Okay. Man, this is gonna take forever. <laughs> this is gonna take forever. it disappears then. Ah.
Gotcha. Okay, 2600. Come on, can I just, like, chill and go down the side here? Darn. Um. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I probably don't even need to do that just yet. I probably need to make my way onto that platform first. Oh, and I slid right off. I tried to finesse it a little bit too much. Alright, land. Cool. Oh man. But I'm pretty sure that's the idea. I'm not even really supposed to be worrying about it just yet. Oh wait, I thought I died. Darn it, every single time I do the, the dash and I'm like close to some scenario where I think I'm gonna die, I always think I end up dying. There we go. All right, so now we'll need to save one of our dashes, it seems. That was totally off. Okay, do these strawberries count for this world or this chapter? I wonder. Darn. Oh wait. All right, over here, then back down like that, okay. Again, I'm not gonna get any of my dashes back, but I definitely need one by the time I get over here. So the question then is, like that, cool. 2700. Does that restore one or two? Just one, it seems. Oh, I keep... <laughs> again, I keep thinking I'm dying there. No, why didn't I hit up? There we go. Alright, I'm gonna... <laughs> this has been so long of an episode just because I'm too stubborn about splitting this up. Oh, I missed that completely. Let's, um, let's try and get this level or maybe like two more and then... And then we can kind of try and figure it out from there. Or, by that I mean definitely call it for the episode <laughs> because there's no way I can actually finish this finish this chapter in this episode with how long it's been taking darn I need to figure out how to stabilize myself in that little interim while I wait for the uh, platform to come back why do I keep thinking I can wall jump off of the side of the screen I know I can't do that and the first few times I had done the level, I knew I couldn't and didn't as well. Ooh. No! No! Go back! Oh man. Now playable from the main menu. Please. Please tell me I can go back to that level and get that strawberry. Because that's going to kill me. Oh man, that's, uh, now I'm ending the episode on such a sour note. <laughs> oh man. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. All this clutter, all this haunted hotel probably from this silly Mr. Oshiro ghost and this Pico 8 machine, which is so extensive apparently. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Regardless, I'll, in the next episode we'll finish up this chapter and move on to the next one. But until then, this is Moon Knight Zero and this mission is complete.